such temptation. I loved many in my day, but never one so fair. Grace, elegance, just waiting to be shattered. Oh, yes, I know your bliss. A sturdy dwarf, a leather whip, she gives, you receive. Or have I misjudged you? One of those, are you? There's plenty of room for role play in our establishment. If you have a change of heart and wish to be subdued, it's Fion you should speak to when she comes back. Well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink for one, a pair of drow for another. Choose your sin. Swishing. I'm no fortune teller. If I had a crystal ball, I promise I'd already have consulted it. Truth is, Fionn's gone well missing. And my hands may be skillful, but they were not made to turn every last stone she might be hiding behind. <laughs> to service is my calling, not to be served. Ugh, but I'd be a fool to say no. The girl kept my coffers near overflowing. Two flights up, then turn right and right again. That's Fionn's pleasure room, Elminster's library. Here, take the key. I'm listening. Twins, yes. Hands of such skill they could turn stone to silk. Your body could suffer no knot they can't untangle. They're through the curtain to the right. You'll need coin and stamina in abundance to enjoy their services, but the gold will be as well spent as you are. By the mother of cats, I pray she didn't suffer. They'll miss that face. Else, the regulars will miss her more. They swarmed her like honeybees at the hive. Oh. Losing Fion slashed a big hole in my coin purse. I should get to replacing her. Sweeting. This is Baldur's Gate. I've seen more murders than a butcher's right eye. There'll be time for tears. Cruel as it is, I must turn my mind to business, or, more precisely, the lack of it. I have little coin, but I offer sin in abundance. Talk with the drow twins in the tap room. They're legends among the regulars, almost myths. Tell them they will gift from the mamzelle, and let them show you why. Anything else on your mind, sweetie? Nisha, our lovely nymph. But she's engaged in the nymph's grotto on the top floor, sweeting. The client's a favorite of hers, too. I doubt you'll be able to tear her away. But we are blessed to have a devil in residence at the moment. A temporary guest. But he asked that I send any potential clients his way. Everyone who's paid a visit looks quite changed by the experience. Indeed he did. Raphael, exceedingly handsome, and with a voice that could make the foulest blasphemy seem the sweetest hymn. 